The governor of Missouri signed Senate Bill Number 43 into law last year, which, according to Tim'sLaw.com, makes plaintiffs prove that the discrimination was the motivating factor rather than a contributing factor. Somebody could fire you for being a woman, and they could say that you know part of the reason why you're fired was a woman, but you were late on Tuesday, and that's why they fired you. And the way the bill used to be, uh, the way it used to be in Missouri was, it wasn't about a motiva- motivating factor, it just had to be a, a factor. A few lawmakers in Missouri are looking to overturn the law that gives power to discrimination. Actually, I refused to vote on that bill because uh, quite, and I think there was 36 of us total that refused to actually take a vote on that bill in the House. I think, given the reaction uh, to the bill itself, uh, it's clear that not all of the uh, consequences of this legislation were taken into account. So I think they're going to have to figure out a solution. The governor stated in his signing that he is trying to make it easier for businesses to operate in Missouri. Seven bills, six from Democrats and one from a Republican, have been filed this year that would reverse all or parts of Senate Bill Number 43. I think what is really an issue here is, you know, how far do we want those regulations to go? To what degree do they curtail the normal functionings of business? Um, That's a public discussion that has to be had, and there needs to be greater consensus. We can't have one party uh, pushing one thing and another party pushing another uh, because we'll never find the common ground. I am sympathetic to the idea that sometimes regulations favor the trial lawyers more than they do the actual victims of the uh, purported uh, discrimination, and I do think there's probably some room for reform. Uh, But I think this was pretty far-reaching in terms of changing the situation, and I think that's problematic. Some people can see this bill as something good, and others see it as a negative path for Missouri to continue on. Senate Bill 43 was signed in June of 2017, and some Missouri lawmakers are beginning the process of overturning it. This is Gabby from Cougar News, signing off.